of Museums in Santo Domingo or Noche Larga de los Museos Amon Calle de las Damas where it all starts happening. All the museums are free until midnight and this uh, edition's theme is merengue. Dominican merengue in December 2016 was added to the UNESCO list as a cultural heritage of humanity. Merengue is the national music and dance of the Dominican Republic. It represents the essence of what it means to be Dominican. So today they're celebrating this all day long and we're gonna go and we're gonna check out tons of live merengue instruments and a big concert tonight featuring major Dominican merengue artists. So it's gonna be tons of fun and I'm gonna show you the museums. Let's go! Fortaleza Osama is the first military fortress in the Americas and it has an impressive medieval castle-like design overlooking the Rio Osama and the cannons that defended the old city. It's a must see. Make sure you go all the way up on the fortress. Don't stop on the first level because it's, it's tricky but there are other stairs that you can take. This really, really winding staircase. <laughs> Ooh. Defending Santo Domingo. Woo. First city of the Americas. One of the most visited sites is the Alcazar de Colón. This used to be the home of Christopher Columbus's son, Diego Colón, and his wife, Maria de Toledo. They built a palace, and his dad, Christopher Columbus, actually never got to see the finished home. Uh, you can view period furniture, lots of art, old musical instruments, and the bedrooms of Maria de Toledo and Diego Colón. Don't miss the spiral staircase that takes you all the way to the top floor veranda with an amazing panoramic view of the Rio Osama in Santo Domingo's port. One of the prettiest museums is also its most visited, Museo de las Casas Reales, where you will find the colonial history of Santo Domingo from the arrival of Colón and his three ships to the brutal days of slavery and the sugarcane industry. These are just a few of the museums. There's a lot more and they are free during Noche Larga de los Museos. This edition ended with a big bang merengue concert on Plaza España. Don't forget to grab your copy of Moon Dominican Republic guidebook now available on amazon.com. Por eso, básicamente que la UNESCO lo nombra Patrimonio de la Humanidad, porque tenemos una cultura tan sólida. Somos una de las de los pueblos más musicales de América. Somos uno de los pueblos que más ritmo tiene. Que más ritmos musicales tiene, más expresiones musicales originales tiene pero la base del merengue no hay quien pueda con ella no hay quien la corrompa ni, no hay, ni hay quien la tumbe la base del merengue todo el que quiera hacer música dominicana tiene que basarse en esos compases esto es dominicanidad y el que se salga de ahí lo lamento pero está para eso <risa>